All right, guys, Real Talk here with Mike Johnson. And this, we had a pre-show chat and I started telling him about Joshua Braun and his grades, his ACTs, his master's degrees. But I think where I got old school Mike Johnson is when I started telling him about <laughs> tennis and yeah. playing doubles and swing dancing. Woo. Now, we're gonna evaluate a tennis player, swing dancer, national merit finalist, two brothers played at Georgia Tech for multiple seasons. Mike Johnson, what do you see right out of the gate here when we're talking about Joshua Braun out of Live Oak, Florida? Usually when we talk about a lot of these high school prospects, you know, I, I've used the term gripper. Sometimes the, the term finesse comes out. Sometimes, you know, this guy's a mauler. I, I think mauler is the, is the best word. I mean, he's just such a big specimen, but you can tell he understands footwork. He understands uh, leverage with his hands. You can be as big as you want to. That right there is nothing but sheer explosion. And I think when you see that size and, and kind of finesse combination, it gets you so excited about what that kid can possibly bring to your team. But I don't see other word, any other word to use here other than Mahler. This guy absolutely lines up next to anybody. He's going to make any D lineman look small next to that big old frame. And these, these poor guys in this film, I mean, it, there, there's no chance. This guy is going to absolutely maul you to death. He's going to get his hands on you. He's going to move you out of the way. And I'll use a term here for some of you science guys, inertia. This guy's got inertia in his favor. And every time he gets to moving forward, there's not a lot of people that are going to stop him in his path. So there you go. You get Mike, Mike Johnson talking about a kid with a 4-0 and start using those big lineman words like inertia. <laughs> his dad, Mike, is an offensive line coach. Can you really pick up Coach's Kid from this film, from the first five clips? Absolutely, because I think it's easy for a guy that's, that, that's that big. <laughs> Goodness gracious. It's easy for a guy that big to get into high school and say, oh, I can dominate and I don't have to worry about technique. I don't have to worry about some of the different things. But watch his ability to, first of all, accelerate his feet, but keep a good base. You, you know, I harp all the time with some of the kids that I coach, get your second step on the ground. If both of your feet are on the ground, it allows you to react to the movement of the defense. If one of your feet are off the ground, guess what? You can't really you know, move left to right. You can't really react. You can tell right now he focuses on getting his second step on the ground and really keeping a good base. And it allows him to be that mauler. It allows him to continue moving at the defense of people and they can't just kind of matador out of the way and, and kind of wash him by. I mean, you can see him getting up in the third level right here. This poor kid did not want any of that. So the thing we like about Braun is his, he's, he checks every box because we've just talking about his mauling ability. I think he needs a pair of purple pants with that green jersey. He can look <laughs> like the Incredible Hulk. But here's what I also see. You watch him work and you watch all the things he can do, and, but yet his older brothers both played three years, started three years at Georgia Tech. Combine that with his dad being a high school offensive line coach. Mike, can you imagine any other kid coming in with a better width of knowledge to play offensive line than this young man? Uh, it's going to be huge. And that's really, uh, that combined with the fact that so many of these kids nowadays are showing up early with early enrollments. You didn't have that 10 years ago. Uh, it, it, this is the kind of guy that can line up right away and make a difference on a football team. And a lot of Georgia fans look at it and say, well, you know, this is a kid that, you know, we've, we're really loaded up front. We've got, you know, five-star guys across the board. But watch this guy go to work and watch him get in a college weight room and get college nutrition the way they have at Georgia and watch how this kid blossoms. All of a sudden, uh, you know, B plus foot speed might go to A minus foot speed and that might go to A foot speed. And then you find yourself really uh, a generational talent among offensive linemen. And, and, and with the weight and size he has, he's going to be able to run over a lot of people, even in SEC play. All right, guys. So if you guys were playing Real Talk Bingo, we checked off swing dancer, tennis, <laughs> coach's kid, gripper, and inertia. inertia. That's a first here for Real Talk. That's Mike Johnson. He knows all about this stuff. I'm Jeff Centel. We just get him talking. Hope you enjoyed our Real Talk on Joshua Braun.